In this video, I'm going to show you how to find uh, group policy objects that are unlinked. Um, so th these are basically GPOs that are not in use. So when you look at your GPOs in the group policy management console, um, you may see some of them that have a location is empty um, versus one that has a location. So what this means is when the location like this is blank, it means that group policy object is not in use. So um, with the group policy management console, there's no way to see them all. You have to click on each group policy object to look at the location. So these are GPOs that you may that may not be, you may not have a use for them anymore and you can delete them, but you need to review those and determine that. So to find all of them with group policy or with PowerShell, um, can run this command and I'll paste this in the comment section. Um, you can just copy and paste this and it's going to go uh, look at all of your GPOs and find ones that do not have a link. So what this is doing is it's grabbing all GPOs and it's sending it to the GPO, get GPO report command. It's piping that out to an XML and then it's looking in that XML for a string match. Um, so if a GPO is linked to an OU or to the domain, it's going to have a linked to section in that XML. If it doesn't, it's not going to have a links to. So I'll run this. So you can see, I'll pause this because I have a bunch of GPOs that are not in use. But come back here, probably here, it's showing me the GPO display name, the creation date, and modification time. So if I go back to my group policy management console, I'll just verify a couple of these. Um, so BitLocker. BitLocker, you can see location is blank. Uh, allow log on locally. Allow log on local. And that's blank. So that's a quick, uh, just a simple command to find all of your GPOs that are not in use. And you can also do that with our Active Directory Pro Toolkit. Just come under reports, group policy reports. And there's an empty GPOs report and an unlinked GPOs report. So click this and it's going to do the same thing but it's going to give you a bit more of information here but you can see location is blank it's giving me the gpo name and some other information and there's also a empty gpos so this is going to show you all your group policies that have no settings so this is a little different location it's going to show you location too but you can see i've got a couple of gpos that are linked uh, but they're empty so if I went into the Group Policy Management Console op and opened these up, you're going to see they have no settings. So computer lock screen all, computer lock screen all, if I do settings, there's nothing configured. This is just, you know, the default delegation stuff. So these are some additional GPOs that can be reviewed and possibly uh, cleaned up. Um, and you can download this the AD Pro Toolkit and do a 14 day fully functional trial. Uh, but again, I will put this command, PowerShell command in the uh, comments. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.